Asante sana your excellency. Najua ni ngumu sana kuongea after his excellency speaks. Lakini habari yenu? Nzuri. Habari yenu leo? Nzuri. Tini nawapenda tu. Nawapenda sana. Na ndio maana tuko hapa leo. Tumekuja hapa kwa sababu ya ile upendo watu wako naye. Nayo huko nje yenu. Na umesikia hata his excellency ametoa roho yake yote. Ndio? La kwanza Jambo la kwanza your excellency ninajua wengine hapa si kuna tumakosa tumewekelewa yeah. ni wangapi wamewekelewa <laughs> si unaona so hii makosa iko hapa yote your excellency tunafaa kutatua ndio hawa watu watoke kwa hii jela yeah. na jambo moja Ningependa kwa sababu mimi sina uwezo ya kukutoa yule jaja kwa pale ndio wako na uwezo. Kuna ile maneno inaitwa review of your cases. Si ndio? Yeah. Mnasumbua ofisa na hiyo? Si ndio? Ofisa yako wapi? Ah <coughs> watu wana review cases zao. Inakuwa reviewed. Ukienda hapo kwa judge, tafadhali mwambie hautarudia ama ulifanya au kufanya na ujitetee kwa sababu hiyo ni njia moja tunatumia kundiko jest our prisons. Hatutaki kuona numbers mingi tumekaa pamoja. Jambo la pili. Jambo la pili. Huyu ofisa mnaona hapa. Akiingia tu kwa the power of mercy committee online. Na aseme yule jamaa amekaa hapa miaka kumi, miaka tano, miaka kumi na tano, Naona kama amerekebika. Ndio? Yeah. Unamuingizia mambo hapo unasema huyu ako sawa. His excellency ako na pawa ya kukuachilia siku moja. Kwa hivyo tungependa kama umekaa hapa ukae uendelee ukirekebika. Kama ni makosa iliingia kidogo. Na ndio ujue ya kwamba kuna mambo His excellency ametaja hapa hiyo kwenda ukigusa gusa kila kitu barabarani uache sababu hiyo ni makosa kidogo sana yenye inakulete hapa your excellency i'm very delighted that you have come at a time yenye tunapanga kufanya one bed one mattress one prisoner kwa sababu hawa ni binadamu kama sisi na tungependa kuona pia nyinyi ukiishi maisha mzuri hapo baadaye. Hii makosa imeingia ni kidogo tu. Na kwa sababu ameomba aanzishe hiyo mradi sisi tumeitikia. Aleta mattress. Aleta ile mkeka, aleta mattress na wacha hawa watu walale vizuri. La pili kuna wale watu wako hapa kwa sababu hawangepata pesa ya bill. Unajua ukame na uchumi ni mbaya pale nje. Hata sisi hapa ni degree tu ya hiyo ukame. Labda mwingine anataka 500, kuna mwingine anataka 1500, si ndio? Kwa hivyo wale wameshindwa na kulipa hiyo. Na labda hata kesi zao zijasikikwa ama wengine wako hapa walishindwa na kulipa hiyo bill tumekuitikisha. Endelea, tafadhali. <laughs> Hii workforce iko hapa tunaona These are productive people in the society and we need you out there. Lakini kuteleza sio kuangua. Kurudia ndio Very good. Ukirudi pale urudie. Tutakurudisha tu hapa. Tena hata tutakufunga maisha. Sasa wacha kurudia hiyo makosa umefanya. Kuteleza sio kuanguka, kurudia ndio makosa. Rate ya recidivism is very high. 
na ndio maana tunaomba ukiwa hapa ndani we are engaging you from end to end kuna hawa watu wanaitwa wa probation office tunaomba Mary yako wapi tunaomba your psychologists your counselors walete hapa kila siku ndio tuwe tunaongea tunaongea tuna communicate sometimes you may do a crime out there because of lack of knowledge maybe because you don't know the law labda ujui sheria na ndio maana umekosa so tunaomba wale wanaweza wakakusaidia ukiwa hapa ndani utaenda ukasaidia wengine <laughs> na tumeomba pia county commissioner na wako hapa ajadiliane na sisi tushikane mkono county government national government um, Kenya um, correctional services tushikane pale vijijini ndio pia pale mmetoka tuongee na watu wenu you know reconciliation is a medicine to the soul kuna ile kitu umefanyia mtu na ulipokuja hapa umeanza ku feel yenyewe nilikosea huyo mtu na nikapata tu nafasi tu mmoja ningemwambia sorry si ndio sikuenda pale tulete hao watu you reconcile kwa sababu hata ukitoka na uko na hiyo uh, bitterness kwa roho yako na yeye pia ako na bitterness kwa roho yako si mtaenda mpigane tena mtaenda mpigane tena so tungeomba county government um, the county commissioner and correctional services we are going to join hands to make sure that reconciliation is happening in our homes reconciliation is happening in our villages in our communities in our societies because alternative dispute resolution must start from the basic it must start from the bottom of the pyramid it must start from where you are in your nuclear family tunaomba mkitoka huko nje muta ha vizuri na sisi na tukienda hapa tutaenda kuwatetea ndio hata ukiwachiliwa governor akikulipia hiyo fine Una, unajua unaweza enda hapo wakuchukue juju wakurudishe waseme bado we ni mtu mbaya so sisi tunataka kushikana pamoja hiyo hii mambo tuendeleze vizuri otherwise nimefurahi sana kuwaona na kama PS wa correctional services niko committed to ensure you are your welfare is catered for because even in the global arena tunafaa kuwa uh, kuwa tunashikana na nyinyi na namna kama maisha mzuri to the officers who are here our officers na waomba hawa ni binadamu watunze ilivyo <laughs> na pia nyinyi usifanye kosa kwa ofisa kwa sababu unafikiria ofisa ameambiwa wewe ni binadamu ni vizuri mshikiliane hawa officers wako trained na wako trained kuku handle wako trained kukuonyesha namna ndio maana tunaitwa correctional services we are not a punishment arena we are a corrective area and that is what we want to be continue so hawa officers ni marafiki wenu na wanafaa kuwa marafiki wenu kuendelea wana kukorekt wanakuambia venye unataka ukiwa na jambo lenye unataka na ukiwa na jambo lenye una feel that lazima itatuliwe ongea na wao ongea na officer in charge najua nimetembea hii nchi na nimeongea mambo ya wamama wenye wana, wako na watoto uh, magerezani na ningependa kusema ninajua kuna baba hapa ako single father. Si tunaelewa hivyo? There is something called remote visit. Ati mtoto wako anaweza kuja hapa akutembelee. Angalau mtoto asisahau baba ni nani. We have that in mind. I know we had stopped it kwa sababu ya COVID. I know there's an outbreak of cholera right now also. So when things stabilize we are going to reintroduce the remote parenting for the single fathers who are in prison. So we care about you a lot. Tuna shughulika mambo yenu sana na tungependa tushikiliane ora ka ukirekebika. Sawa sawa? Asanteni sana Mungu mwema awaweke vyema na nitakuja hapa tena. Asante.
Thank you.